Okay, guys, if we can keep this up for two more periods, we'll pull this thing off. Yep. Go, go. <laughs> Excuse me, Mrs. Robinson. Could you please inform the faculty that I'll be calling a mandatory meeting in 40 minutes and make sure that Mr. Hightower is there to present the music department budget? <laughs> okay, okay. I know this looks bad, but we have to stay cool so we can think and come up with a plan to... Oh, my God! <laughs> this is going on my permanent record. I'm going to be expelled. I'll never graduate from Yale Drama School. I'll never play the role of Eliza Doolittle in the Broadway revival of My Fair Lady. <laughs> Calm down, Lydia. It's okay. You can always go to Truck Masters with me and Romeo. If you play it right, you can make deliveries too, Broadway. Would you all chill? I am the one that could get fired if I don't get Steve back here in time. I need a cell phone. See, man, I just knew your little million dollar idea was gonna get us kicked out of that tournament. Look, man, when Regis said no to your bro balls, that was his final answer. I'm sorry, Steve. I mean, I know how important this tournament was to you, and I had to go and ruin it. I feel really bad. I guess my black balls were just ahead of their time. <laughs> hey, lovey. Oh, uh oh, okay, no, 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 we'll be there. All right, Steve, we gotta get back to the school. Regina and called a faculty meeting. Damn, all right, let's go. Wait a minute, man. I came to this tournament intending to win. I am not walking out of here empty-handed. to start the meeting. I'll just go get Steve. But you can't. Why not, Levita? Is there something that I should know? <laughs> yeah. You have been showing me so much appreciation this week that I want to show some appreciation for you. I wrote you a poem. Well, that's very sweet, Levita. I'll just hear it later. B! It's the boss lady. O! It's for... Oh, how I love working for Boss Lady. S is for sophistication and sass. Now, two S's. Thank you, Levita. But you didn't hear what the L is for. L! Okay, people, that's it. You are so busted. You tried to cover up for that trifling Mr. Hightower, where well, I can see right through this dummy. <laughs> Steve, what are you doing here? You were at that golf tournament. I heard your name on TV. No, no, no. I was supposed to be at the golf tournament, but I canceled as you wished. And you show your gratitude by slapping me in front of these kids. I feel so cheap and humiliated for all the wrong reasons. Attention, people. I'm sorry. Carry on. Well, I don't know about these young, impressionable minds, but I, for one, cannot accept your apology because I am too very, very deeply wounded. Well, lady, I can't take it anymore. This whole day has been nothing but lies, lies, lies. Steve was never here. He went to the tournament. And the kids, they covered for him, and I helped. Please forgive me. Yes, yeah, see you two at Truckmasters. You know, Regina, on second thought, I think that I will accept your apology. <laughs> now, if you'll all excuse me, I have a faculty meeting I have to attend. Attention, people. You're busted again. 